So now that we've talked about Euler circuits, uh, let's return back to this bridges problem, because if you'll notice, the, the idea was the, the, uh, townsfolk folks would see if they could find a route that would take them across every bridge once and return them to where they started. And if you remember, we represented this, uh, as a graph by introducing a vertex for each of the land masses and then an edge for each of the bridges that could be taken to walk from one, uh, land area to another. And so our graph ends up looking like, uh, you can really see it over there, but in case if you're having trouble, uh, looks like this. And so the question we could ask is, is it possible to find a route that would take them across every bridge once and return them to where they started? And you'll notice that if we look at the degree of these vertices, we have degree 1, 2, 3, degree 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, degree 1, 2, 3, and degree 1, 2, 3. So it turns out that no, there is not an Euler circuit for this, uh, bridges scenario, uh, for the bridges of Kunisberg. And, and in fact, there's not even an Euler path, right? Be uh, because we have two, f all of our vertices here have odd degree. It's more than just a pair. And so there's no way to even start in one location, cross every bridge once, and end up uh, in a different place, uh, there's no way to cross every bridge once without visiting, uh, without having to cross a bridge twice.